Alright, hey guys, here we have a Casablanca Star in gloss black. Picked this up earlier today. Uh, this actually almost completes my modern Casablanca lineup. I believe the only thing left is the uh, Malibu Star. Er, yeah, Malibu Star. Um, this is actually a huge childhood fan of mine. Um, my mom's hairstylist actually had one of these in her apartment. Um, not black, it was actually white. Anyways, um, she, my mom used to go to uh, her actual salon, and they had three, I don't know, builder fans or whatever. But one of these times, she actually went to her apartment, which, um, you know, it didn't actually have any fans installed, but it had, what was it, it was, it had like one of those little, like, not permanent walls, that kind of like traditional, like, I don't know, kind of like fake walls, I don't really know what you'd call it, just kind of, just like, it was kind of more like a decoration type of thing, but it had one of these, um, sitting off, you know, to the corner of the room, sitting upright in white, and, um, you know, obviously, you know, big giveaway was the holes in the blades, that's one of the main reasons I knew, I don't know if I ever really put it together, that, uh, that's what it was until recently. Uh, I think at one point I thought it was an Atlantis, but the blades didn't come together. It was like, it was a star. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so she had one of those sitting off to the side, and, you know, obviously I asked, you know, to have it, and I don't... No, either she didn't... No, she probably took me seriously, because I always used to play with the fans at the salon while my mom was getting her hair done. Um, I don't know, either she knew what it was, or she just wasn't wanting to get rid of it. So yeah, I always kind of love these. Um, these actually aren't too far off from the stealth. The only difference is operating system and motor. Um, the way the blades mount is virtually the same. The only difference, you know, there's obviously three instead of five. The light kit is kind of the same. The top of the housing is the same. The way the blades mount is about the same. Um, actually, the Atlantis mounts much like this, the Homestead Atlantis. And while we're on that, technically, the Star is a Homestead product because it was a Homestead product, and then it switched over to the Airflow by Casablanca lineup. Anyways, enough about that. Let's demonstrate the light. This does feature Casablanca's first touch system. If I hold down the button, it'll actually dim until it gets all the way off and back on. Um, I believe there were two generations of this. This fan is from the early 90s, or not early 90s, either late 90s or early 2000s, I'm not entirely sure. Um, it had two, there was two different VersaTouch systems. I think there was the VersaTouch 1 and VersaTouch 2. I don't really know the difference. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Here it is on low. Um, not really sure if those the um, hole in the blade is actually just design or if it actually serves a purpose. I'm gonna say it probably serves um, a purpose just as much as it has, you know, for the design because um, those are very wide blades. Those are almost eight inches wide. And, you know, that'd be a lot of drag on the motor. And it'd probably slow it down considerably. So I think the wind actually goes through there. Go to medium. And actually, these blades are not wood like most other Casablancas. They are, um, I think, either PVC or some sort of plastic. So if you really felt you know, the need, you could actually install one of these outside. I don't, I don't know how great that would be for the electronics, but if, you know, if you really wanted to push your luck, you could, you know, you could put one of these out there, outside. Um, humidity is one of the main things that I'm sure would kill one of these. Go to high.
it does have a little wobble. As you can see, though, it is a spinner motor, or what Casablanca like to call it, it is direct drive. It pushes out as much as um, K55. One thing I don't know is whether or not the one in my mom's stylist's room was a homestead or if it was a Casablanca. I don't think I paid enough attention to the canopy. I just saw it and thought it was the coolest thing. I was As a kid, I thought three-bladed fans were the coolest thing. Um, and when I started collecting, I was still like that until I kind of got into the you know, more of quality fans type of thing. You know, when I started looking, okay. When I started looking, I was going for, when I first started, I was looking for Hunter, and then I found stuff on Hunter, and, you know, I wasn't sure if all that was true, so I went to YouTube, um, ended up finding Dan's videos, and things started progressing, and, you know, for some reason, I had the eye set on Hunter, and then I ended up joining a Facebook group that said Hunter was awful, and it just kind of snowballed out of, you know, the whole newer Hunter garbage. And, you know, I started collecting Casablancas. Um, you know, obviously I'm still looking for industrials, it's just kind of my thing. But this right here, this is, I think this is really cool. I'm not sure if you can see the uh, SMC off to the right, but that's also another one of my uh, favorites. Hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching.